Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Roxanne and uh, today we are going to be doing a little get to get ready with me with doing an unboxing and I was just at Winners and I'll show you what I got from Winners. Okay, so I am going to had little scissors there. there. Okay. So I'm going to open this up and show you what's in it. So uh, Lancome had a mystery box. So I am a sucker for mystery boxes. Um, yeah. And I love Lancome. I haven't used it in a while, but I am a big, big, big fan. So um, this is still available. Ooh, and then I'll show you what I got. Uh, one thing I do like about Lancome is that you can kind of stack. So the um, mystery bundle was $70. And then for five extra dollars, you got, if you put five dollars of extra stuff, um, you could get another bundle worth like $60, $70. So that's what I did. So there's some things on sale. Yeah, I got a lacquer. Regular $34 on sale for $23. And free shipping. Okay, so this is... There's a... So I will use that today. And this is the kit I got. Ooh. So it comes with a little eyeshadow. Let's see here. Oh, that's a little blush. Um, eye sh sh primer, um, eyelash primer, a little thing of Monsieur, Mr. Monsieur, Monsieur Big Lancome, and has a little lipstick in with it which I likely will not use because it is more of a brown, but I might. This is, ooh la la. And then this, is, I love this stuff, so I'm really glad to have it. I really like the bag too. So when you sign up for Lancome, you can, there's different uh, points. And one of them, the basic one is the rose. And so if you spend more than $75, you get a gift. So, and it just depends on how much you spend in the year. Okay, so I think the rest of this. And then I got two free um, samples. I don't know why my, my anxiety is really high right now. Okay, so. big bucks for small amount of things. It's kind of disappointing. Okay, so... So let's start. So this is Rouge in Love High Potency Color 6 Hour Wear Feather Light So I know I have a little one of these. Oh, that's gorgeous actually. That is a gorgeous color. So I would definitely be using that. Okay, so this is Creamy Eyeliner All Day in Cafe Noir. I mean, I do have lots of eyeliners. This one is brown. I think anyway. It's kind of a brown black. 
Okay. I do like their eyeliners. They're really, really nice. Okay, so this is High Definition Mascara in black. So, I never have too many mascaras, I guess. Okay, so it said it was a makeup kit, but it's like just eyes. And then this is a booster, which I do like, and I think I have one already, so I will likely uh, just kind of tuck this away. So I just want to, I know it had, they do have two skincares. One is for, or one is for skincare, which is 125 and one is a makeup mystery bundle. So it was seventy dollars, I think. Lip to eye products of our icons. Okay, so let's see here. I just want to. items okay so this is $34 on its own there's two here one is 17 oh I think that's just the that must be the small one okay so and this is waterproof so that's kind of nice So, high definition mascara. So this one here, defensive. Yeah. So this is thirty six dollars. So between that and this, that's seventy dollars there. So I basically like kind of paid for these two items, and I got the eyeliner and lipstick for free. Okay. So let's see here. So, eyeliner. Eyeliners and eye pencils. Kind of wish they would have sent me like a purple or a pink. But. Okay, so this is $36. And it's kind of interesting because they could have sent me like a cheaper one. They have a, a crayon. But no, and I mean it's only $2 more. And then there's um, Drama Le Puy Pencil. Ooh, and it's got a nice purple. Okay. Okay, so then... We'll go to lipsticks. Then we'll do rouge and love. So they did, I mean, like, I really like this color, so. Don't see it. Oh, wait. No. Rouge and Love. Okay, so the Rouge and Love is actually sold out and it was sold for $33. So it's 139 and that's what these are the value would be. So um, they probably already have like <coughs> a few of these made up, excuse me. So anyway, um, whoops, set this aside because I think I already have one. I'm just going to check. Did I pull it out already? No, I don't think so. Okay, so my eyeliners are over there, so. See, I 
do have a small one. So. Okay. Oh, so. Eh, I don't know how to feel exactly about that, but I mean, I'm not really that disappointed. Um, And then I'm going to show you what I got at Winners. I found this at Winners. So, yeah. Maybe I'll have to give this a, a try. Um, I know... I know there's a few people looking for this right now, so... Um, So I, did ha I do have a second one, so I'm not sure if I'm going to sell this one or put this one in a giveaway. We'll have to wait and see what uh, comes up. So, okay. There we go. So there is the palette. Oh, that would be better. Okay. So... Let's see here. And I know I already actually already have this one, so I'm actually gonna put that in there. And this is the blush, which I already have a blush that I really like, so. Oops. I think I want to try this color out sometime. Isn't that gorgeous? And the dramatic kind of looks like a purple, but it's not. So I will give that a try out later time. Okay, so let's start this getting ready with me and we'll have a quick chit chat about my new job and life and whatever else. So um, I didn't do a video Friday. I don't think I did one Thursday. Um, so I'm going to start with my vitamin C uh, glow from Smashbox. I actually really like this. Very, smells very fresh, very clean. And it makes my face feel really, really, really good. Um, okay, so I am going to use the Perfect Cover by BB Cream by Misha. Um... And it was funny, I was going through some of my stuff and I found um, one of the sponges that I had and I thought I'd lost it, but no, I just had put it someplace because I don't use sponges very often, except for as of late. It seems like I'm using them more. Okay. So I didn't, I was planning on doing a video yesterday and I just, so tired. So it's going to take me some time, but I hope to get into the regular motions of doing videos as I have officially quit my 40 hour a week job not to do videos but I do have another job that I did get hired on for right now it is just part time so I'm hoping that I can get a few more videos out and do some new stuff as well um, this week I don't work until Wednesday, and so we'll see how this week goes, whether I'll do some get readies with me or trying different palettes and stuff like that, different ways to get ready, and let you know what my, you know, my favorites and whatnot. So I'm going to use the e.l.f. under eye. Um, I do want to mention, so we've gotten quite a few items in our boxes lately. So, um, I'm going to use the Morphe. So I'm not going to fast forward this, but I am going to try to talk and work at the same time. Um, I'm just going to add a little bit of coverage right there. So I just finished... 
the Glam Glow Good in Bed, and um, I have to say I really, really enjoyed using it. I am glad I am done, so I am going to either switch over to another nighttime one or just use, and I'm using this, uh, what is it, Ceram? I got in, I think, Glossy Box last month, and then I'm going to hopefully move on to Sunday Riley if I don't get products to review in the next little while. Okay. Um, nice thing about my new job is I can actually wear makeup to it. I'm not saying I couldn't do my factory job, it just kind of was a waste because I sweat so much. So. Okay, that is done. Put those items away. clean up my desk again it's gotten so crazy lately um okay so there's that so let's get into this palette let's see what there is to it um probably won't attack the um the glitter glitter shades only because I don't have glitter glue and I'm just going to be in the house so I really don't need them. So I am going to go in with it's a designer here and just kind of use it as a base. I am going to put on I do have Too Faced eyeshadow I know I do I just have to find it mm. oh, it's pretty vulgar oh there it is yeah, shadow insurance so I'll put on some of that um, so. so I made my choice for oh my gosh it's been a busy week for choices so I made my choice for boxycharm uh, base I didn't get a confirmation email, so I'm not sure I will get it. Um, I also put in a, a choice for the premium, which I did get. Um, did my Ipsy choice, as well as my Tribe. Now, Tribe has a very, very interesting spoilers. Um, and I really can't remember any of them right now because, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go in with... It's cashmere right here. Nice soft brown. And I think I'm going to use these two colors. And then maybe this black. No, I'm going to use the pencil. Okay, so there it is there. Tap off your brush. So again, just just mostly on the side here. It is a very, very soft brown, not even really showing up on my skin, which is really weird. So somebody was asking me if I sell any of my products, and yes, if I buy them, I sell them, obviously. If I am gifted them, I either use them or I gift them forward. I do not sell anything I am gifted. I think that just creates a lot of bad karma. I haven't been gifted a whole lot, so um, I'm not saying that to, uh, to make anyone gift me anything either, because, yeah. I try to hold on to the items that I'm gifted and either use them or I gift them to somebody else. Okay, so just want to get rid of that harsh line. So I am going to go in with a smaller angled brush here and I'm going to take this highly selective and it's just a darker, so here, right here.
way darker. But. Kinda almost seems gray. On my skin anyway. So I want to mention that I did try that that jelly mask I got from Thank you. Um, I did try. I'm just going to go in with this. This is cashmere again and just kind of create like a nice little, nice brown. Smoky eye, I guess you would say. Um, yes, yeah, so I tried the um, masquerade. That's what it is called. So I am going to go in with the um, Clutch Your Pearls first. So this one here. <laughs> oh, I got it on my cheek, of course. That is a, such a pretty color. It's not white. It's definitely like a I guess you would call it like a duochrome. Nice pink sheen to it. So yes, I tried the um, jelly face mask and I have to say I really, really liked it. I put it on, hopped in the bath and just sat there with it on and just relaxed and uh, my face did feel a lot tighter, a lot younger. Um, now I'm going to go in with this princess cut. I'm going to use the same brush because and this is the one my brush just fell into. Um, because that color is so light, this one should be a bit darker. So this time I did half and half. And I think I'm going to take a little bit of... I want to try these blues and grays, and maybe I'll do that next time I use this palette. Even maybe tomorrow I'll try it again. I know I have like the James Charles and the Jaclyn Hill palettes I have to kind of get into and I figured they've been out for a while so you've probably seen all the uh, reviews on them so I'll just show you a look that I think I can pull off with it. Um, so I'm going to take out my, oops, I want to put that back actually in the, so I'm going to take a nice stubby round brush and I am going to take I think this brown I'm going to take this brown here right here and I'm just going to put it in between the colors like it's a you know an in between I'm just kind of rub that in a bit As you guys know, I really like my pinks, but I'll try the blue on this and see what it looks like. Not bad. Okay, so that's a pretty rich palette. Like I said, I do have another one. I'm going to stick it in my box there. Okay, so um, I am just going to use a brow gel today, so I'm going to use my... Ico one, I do like this brow gel. So, um, while I'm on the, got your attention, hopefully it's still at this point, um, is there any kind of videos you guys would like to see? Like, would you guys like to see me do, like, reviews, 
uh, skincare, um, maybe going through my own skincare, what I do. I have noticed that since I started like a regimen, um, my skin has become so much clearer. And it's hard to believe I'm actually 38 years old. I'm going to be 40 in a couple years. Um, actually halfway to 39. More than halfway. So, so I'm going to use my um, Lancome crayon. Nice thing is, is it does have a little bit of a smudger on the end, so you can smudge it. So, so don't forget guys. I do have two videos where I'm doing giveaways. So, and I have another box ready to go. And I'm not sure. If I should add it to the 1,000 subscriber giveaway or just do a video completely for it. So... It is so warm back here. We're supposed to get thunderstorms again today. I will say that I do have my son who I haven't seen most of the summer and all of COVID, so I'm excited to spend some time with him. Now, I'm not going to mention exactly where I work because... Um, they don't want, they don't need, like with these videos, I can, really can't discuss anything that I'm doing at that job. Um, I mean, it is a government job, but it's, it's just in retail. So you can kind of put it together from there. If you're a Canadian, if you're in Ontario, you know what I'm talking about. Um, so anything I say or do doesn't reflect on them. It's, you know. I'm trying to like and it's not working but this goes on so smoothly I kind of want it out though ah there we go Oops. I don't know if you guys can see that, but not what I meant to do. Okay, so take my little sponge. Cause we all make mistakes, right? I like to. Maybe it's just me then. I will say that I did smoosh that and it looks so much nicer. Yep, yeah, smoosh is a new word. That is a really cute color. All right, so I do have this little here that I've gotten in another package. And it has, I believe the, yeah, it's the Delicate Oil-Free Powder Blush and Cream Highlighter. So I will use both of those. Um, so. This is a gorgeous blush color. It's a, like a deep purple. So. I didn't really do um, any color under my eye. And I did that purposely just to kind of leave the focus on the brown eyeliner, which I really, really do like. 
I hate when you get something in your surprise bag and you're like, I'm not going to like this. And then you end up liking it. And it's like, so um, I'm also going to leave a link down below if you want to grab this um, mystery bag from them. Um, oh, the highlighter, actually. So I'm just going to use my finger for this one. It is so creamy. Now, I got this in a different package. I don't even, I can't even tell you. It was might have been so long ago, but I never used it. And it was, I don't even think it was open. So. But, oh. Nice, subtle. Look, um... We'll do the the eye lash primer. This is great for when you don't want to wear eyelashes. few seconds to dry out. There's the So yes, this was on sale. This is so pretty. This is a gorgeous color. So I might like try it on with the uh, lipstick as well. So we're going to use the uh, waterproof mascara, which is great because my son almost had me crying on the way home. Nothing bad, just his friend had a really bad accident and he was telling me about him. He's okay. He's doing better and everything. and. I just think how that mother feels and I just, and it could have been my son very easily. It could have been him. This is really nice mascara. I can't look, look how long the lashes are. And that brown is so nice under my eyes from what I can see in the video camera facing me. And I really do like the soft brown behind there. Okay, so I am going to use a uh, lip liner, which of course I do not have. Uh, So I'm actually going to use the uh, NYX. This is the Slim Suede Matte. Sorry, not Slim Suede Matte Lip Liner in Tea and Cookies. There it is there. See, it's a beautiful color. So. So as we're heading towards the end of the month, I still haven't got my Ipsy. Isn't that crazy? I 
like sweating so bad right in here. Okay, so I'm going to put on the lipstick to show you, and then I'm going to put on the lip gloss on the top, and then this on the bottom. I don't know if you can hear that or not, but I apologize if you can. I wasn't supposed to be on the computer playing this game yet. So there it is, the top one. I really like this color. This isn't a bad look at all. I'm glad I picked that up. I'm here was stuck there for a second. Okay, so there we go. That's it, except for like maybe some setting powder, which actually I am going to use. Is it even in there? There it is, the Milani Make It Mask Matte Finish 16 Hour. You guys can see my little fan. Ooh. Anyway, all right, so there is the look. I mean, I actually don't mind this at all. Get a close up look of me. So I actually am pretty happy with the mystery bundle. Do I wish it was a lot less? Yes, because but it is Lancome, and Lancome is super expensive, but it really is worth it. Um, I find that their products are s such great products. Um, this lipstick and the lip combo, the lip gloss combo, I don't feel like I'm being weighed down with um, like heavy lip gloss. It's not sticky. It blended really well, um, even though I put one on top and one on the bottom. Um, I do like the um, color of the eyeliner. It's not something I would have generally picked out, but uh, I think brown suit blue eyes really, really well. Um, I am going to give that pretty rich um, palette another go. Um, yeah, so if you want to grab this mystery bundle, if you are totally up for it, you can use my link below. I think it'll save you some money. But if you can find something that's like 6 or $7, definitely add it in and you will get a free gift. Especially if you sign up. Um, they ha like Lancome has a thing like Sephora does and other products do. Like e.l.f. you get points um, and then you can get free gifts. And at that point you might as well add the $5 and get the free spring gift. And the more points you um, accumulate, the better the gift can be. So, which is really nice. I have to say, um, they're hypnos. It comes in like, oh, it's a beautiful thing. Beautiful jar um, is one of my favorite um, mascaras. But um, I have to say, like, I bought the e.l.f. one and I really, really didn't like it. I have the Wonder Beauty, the Essence, and I really like them. But this is the first time that I've actually put on um, the primer and the mascara. And they're not sticking. It doesn't feel sticky. It doesn't feel like anything. So quality is definitely there for the price um, and really $35, $36 for a mascara actually isn't all that bad. We've seen higher end products go for a lot more. So yeah. And I always buy Lancome during their, um, you buy something and you get a free gift with it. I always do that. I love doing that. And one year I actually even picked up the train case and oh, so... That was so beautiful. I th think I still have this train case somewhere around here. But anyway, um, so yeah, leave me a comment below. Do you like the mystery bundle I got? Um, what do you think of the Pretty Rich 
uh, as well as any ideas for me to do videos in the next coming weeks. Um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, share, and make sure you are subscribed.